Welcome, dear listeners, to another episode of our literature podcast. I'm your host, Susan, and today we're delving into the intricate world of mystery novels, particularly focusing on the philosophical undertones that often thread through these work. Mystery novels have captivated readers for generations, their intricate plots and suspenseful narratives keeping us on the edge of our seats. But beyond the thrilling tales of detective work and unforeseen plot twists, these stories often carry profound philosophical inquiries. They allow us to explore the depth of human nature, our notions of good and evil, justice and morality, and the very fabric of our society. When we think about mystery novels, one of the first names that come to mind is that of Arthur Conan Doyle, the creator of the iconic detective Sherlock Holmes. Holmes's relentless pursuit of truth and justice his unwavering rationality embodies the philosophical quest for knowledge and understanding. His methods and deductions inspire us to question, analyze, and seek truth in our everyday lives. But it's not just about the characters. The very structure of a mystery novel embodies a philosophical journey. The initial presentation of a problem or mystery, the accumulation and examination of evidence the testing of hypotheses, the ultimate revelation of truth, all these mirror the steps of a philosophical or scientific inquiry. The mystery genre often grapples with the question of what is good and evil. Agatha Christie's works frequently involve moral ambiguity, where the villain might have been driven by circumstances or past injustices, adding depth to our understanding of good and evil. Another philosophical aspect prevalent in mysteries is existentialism. Characters in these stories often grapple with existential questions. Who am I? Why am I here? What is my role in the world? Raymond Chandler's Philip Marlowe, for instance, constantly struggles with his sense of self and purpose amid the chaos and corruption he encounters. And then there's the social commentary. Many mystery novels, like those from E.P., James aren't shy about critiquing societal norms and institutions. Through their compelling narratives, they comment on the state of society, reflect on its inadequacies, and question its values, urging readers to do the same. In essence, the mystery genre serves as a mirror to our society and ourselves. It invites introspection and provokes thought all while delivering a gripping tale that keeps us turning the pages. As we lose ourselves in these stories, we are subtly encouraged to question, to ponder, to philosophize. So the next time you pick up a mystery novel, look beyond the hood on it, and you might discover a new perspective on life. Diving deeper into the mysteries of the mystery genre, let's focus on the complex character development often employed in these narratives. At the core of many mystery novels, beneath the thrilling chases and strategic puzzle, solving lies a profound exploration of human psychology. We can see this exemplified in the creation of complex characters who carry their own philosophies, beliefs, and contradictions. Consider the detectives of mystery novels. They are often portrayed as extraordinarily intuitive individuals, capable of seeing what most cannot. Their minds are their most potent tools, always questioning, always doubting, always digging deeper. From Sherlock Holmes' relentless rationality to Hercule Poirot's understanding of human nature, these detectives often exemplify the philosophical quest for truth, challenging readers to question their own perspectives and understanding. The antagonists, too, in mystery novels aren't merely obstacles to be overcome. They often carry their own stories, their own motivations, their own philosophies. Think of the twisted morality of the criminals in Dostoevsky's Crime and Punishment, or the careful plotting of the murderer in Agatha Christie's, and then there were none. These characters challenged the reader to confront the depths of human depravity and the complexity of moral judgments. Mystery novels also engage with philosophical concepts such as fate and free will. 
how much of the story is driven by the character's choices, and how much is predetermined by their circumstances or even the author's design. This tension between determinism and agency reflects larger philosophical debates and adds another layer of depth to the narrative. Now let's turn to the philosophical implications of the mystery genre's primary narrative device, the plot twist. In a good mystery novel, the plot twist isn't just a shock for the sake of shock. It is a revelation that reshapes our understanding of the entire story. The plot twist prompts us to rethink our assumptions, question our perceptions, and reconsider our interpretations, thus embodying the essence of philosophical inquiry. In essence, the power of mystery novels lies not just in their ability to entertain, but also in their capacity to stimulate philosophical thought. Through their gripping narratives, complex characters, and thought, provoking themes, they encourage readers to engage with profound philosophical questions about truth, morality, identity, and society. So the next time you immerse yourself in a mystery novel, remember to look beyond the suspenseful surface, for beneath lies a treasure trove of philosophical insight. Stay with us, dear listeners, as we will delve further into this fascinating intersection of mystery and philosophy in the next part of our podcast. Remember, literature is not just about reading. It's about understanding, interpreting, and growing with the narratives. I'm Susan, and we're exploring the mysteries of literature together. We're back, dear listeners, continuing our conversation on the philosophical undertones hidden beneath the surface of mystery novels. One aspect of mysteries that I find particularly compelling is the way in which they lay bare the intricacies of human nature and motivation. They offer us a wide array of characters, each with their own unique set of moral codes, belief systems, and desires. In understanding the motivations of these characters, whether they be detective, suspect, or victim, we are prompted to grapple with philosophical questions of ethics, morality, and human nature. Think about the quintessential Houdonites plot. Here, we are presented with a group of individuals, one of whom is the perpetrator of a crime. As the narrative unfolds, we're given glimpses into the minds and hearts of each character, leading us to constantly evaluate and reevaluate our judgment of their character. This forces us, as readers, to reflect on our own biases and assumptions, ultimately testing our understanding of human nature. Now let's consider the role of truth and deception in mystery novels. In the pursuit of solving the mystery, characters, and by extension readers are often faced with false leads, hidden truths, and deceptive appearances. This brings to light questions about the nature of truth itself. Is truth always absolute, or can it be subjective? Can there be multiple truths? How does our understanding of truth influence our perception of reality? The detective character, in particular, embodies this philosophical exploration of truth. Their relentless pursuit of the truth, often against a backdrop of lies and misdirection, is a reflection of humanity's innate desire to seek knowledge and understanding. This quest for truth ties back to the Socratic idea that the pursuit of knowledge is the highest form of human achievement. In the world of mysteries, Justice is another concept that's heavily explored. The majority of mystery stories end with the perpetrator being identified and punished, bringing about a sense of justice. But what does justice really mean? Is it simply the punishment of wrongdoing, or is it something more complex? How do societal norms and personal beliefs influence our understanding of justice? These are just some of the philosophical questions that are often provoked when engaging with the theme of justice in mystery novels. In conclusion, mystery novels are far more than thrilling tales of crime and suspense. They are rich with philosophical insight, prompting readers to reflect upon fundamental questions about truth, morality, justice, and human nature. So the next time you're engrossed in a mystery novel, I encourage you to delve beneath the surface and ponder the deeper philosophical questions that the narrative provokes. 
And remember, the joy of reading lies not just in the thrill of the plot, but in the insights we gain along the way. I'm Susan, and you're listening to The Literature Podcast, where we're uncovering the hidden layers of meaning in our favorite books. Stay tuned for the next part of our conversation on mysteries and their underlying philosophy.